What's going on everybody? Welcome back to J Buck Studios Hawkeye Episode 5. We're doing a reaction. Again, I am staying up. I got my trusty coffee right here, nice and warm, in this blue hoodie, doing it, doing it as we can and whatnot. But yeah, let's get into this episode. I, I'm curious on where this is going to go because there's a lot of threads that they haven't really tied up, essentially, with Yelana showing up, who essentially is working for Valentina. Then we have the swordsman and the mother angle, and we have the breakup between Clint and Kate, and we have the uncle character with Maya. Honestly... I don't know how they can wrap everything up in just two episodes, but episode five, let's get into this. Let me know what your theories and stuff you have in the comments down below, whether you're liking this series so far or not. Be sure to follow me on TikTok, and without further ado, let's jump right in. And uh, here we go. Disney Original. Oh, it's going to be a backstory of Yelana, huh? 2018, what's going on? Is this Black Widow and her? Oh, oh, is she one that jumped out and she's they're trying to get yep. <laughs> I don't know, man. This is this action looks a little clunky. I don't know what that was. Did someone just subscribe to my YouTube channel? What the hell? What you thought I was some rich pervert's prisoner? Huh? Well, yeah, kind of. How can you afford all of this? I have a job. The thing we're all best at, killing for money. Didn't think it was going to be she killing for money. My head was definitely in the gutters there. I just remembered that Black Widow happened not in 2023. That's when Avengers Endgame 5 years later. Wow, I am I'm very confused right there for a hot second. Oh, no way! Holy crap! That's how fast it happened for them. This... Ooh, how absolutely terrifying would that be? Oh, my gosh. That was the longest poop ever. <laughs> oh, man. I'm telling you. The more and more we see of the people getting blipped is so interesting and cool. Like, give us a show during that time. I need to tell her I'm okay. I'm glad it cut right there, because if they were going to say that that woman knew what happened in Natasha, I call false, because she literally just got snapped back. They're still fighting. <laughs> or cleaning stuff up. That's probably the best intro, aside from the one from WandaVision. And I wonder if that's what they're going to do, is just have all of these people come back in some fashion. Showing the people getting dusted and whatnot. I'm wondering if they'll show that in all of these uh, episodes. Or not episodes, but shows at some point. Like maybe in She-Hulk, and so forth. Hello, hello. How are they going to get back? How, also, how much time was that? That was six minutes. Jesus Christ. Glad to know he then told me to come home and stay away from him. Mm hmm. Her only friend. You know what? I wonder if she is going to save him. But then he's going to die. You are a superhero. And then she's going to take over the mantle. I bet you regret buying me that first boat, aren't you? Sometimes. <laughs> Cute with that tiny bow. It's so tiny. It's so tiny. That's what she said. <laughs> oh Sometimes the paths we're on, they wind around in ways that we never would have expected to keep moving forward. Even on days when honestly it all just kind of feels like shit. Yeah, uh, like me, uh, doing a reaction at 2 o'clock in the morning drinking coffee. Where about me not has my that. life gone? We found a lot of incriminating stuff about Jack, Mom. Including this shell company that he... I don't know, but you just have to please just promise me that... It's you're not his company. All I ask. It's mine. Okay. It hurts. There I opened up. Oh, they're, they're bonding. L for love!
Yeah, there's a lot going on here, people. A lot of miscommunication. Oh, man, are they gonna kill Clint? Are they gonna find out, kill Clint, Kate's gonna take over, and then Maya's gonna somehow get her own show, even though... Anti-hero? Question mark? Also, for that place burning, it doesn't look that bad. I mean, a new floor, new couch, maybe? Hell, turn it into an Airbnb and just be like, hey, it's a fire-damage-themed Airbnb. Hi. <laughs> Hi. Some. We wanted to make food. <laughs> you have one pork? I'm one person. That's so weird. Oh my gosh, that's a pet peeve of mine. If you live alone, you gotta you gotta have more than one fork, people. I don't have any weapons currently in my hands. To kill you, you would have already. Right as you open the door. Yeah, I probably wouldn't have even had time to shut it. No. I'd have been dead. No. <laughs> Aww, Christmas time. Poor Charlie Brown. Yes. How did the hot sauce not burn? Come on. Come on. Well, the new and improved Statue of Liberty and the Rockefeller Center. <laughs> new Statue of Liberty. What, it's not good? Spider-Man No Way Home. Some recommendations for me. Yeah. Um, oh, come on. Go out on the town yeah, together. Yeah, show her the Christmas tree. Um, there's Please. A Christmas. Are you in New York to talk to Clint? Is that why you're here? No, 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 no. I'm here to kill him. <laughs> oh, I shouldn't have laughed. I have a question. Ooh. Natasha Romanoff, she saved the world. Does she know the story? Stop pretending like you're not surprised. He's still an Avenger. What does that word even mean, huh? <laughs> that it holds so much power. Wait a minute, somebody hired you to kill him? We are defined by what we do. Not by nice words. It's true. Are they Thank my you kiss? For the Truly. They might kiss. What's gonna happen? Is it gonna be Yelana? Kate Bishop, Maya, Kazi, uh, the Swordsman, are they all going after Clint and he's just, it's just gonna be like a free-for-all? Like, hey, why are you here? Wait, why are you here? It's gonna be that Spider-Man thing where they're all pointing at each other. Ooh, pizza dog! I promise you this is all a big misunderstanding. I've never worked a day in my life. Well, we have some tax records that are bad to do. I'm telling you the only- Wait a minute. What? I thought she was colluding with him. Don't blame you for party. You'll see. Oh man, I did not see that coming at all. I thought they were colluding. On the site 2012 during the battle, Steve Rogers, uh, Tony Stank, Thor, Bruce Banner, Natasha, Clint. What's the bottom say? I can't read that. Natasha, I really need to talk to you right now. You were the bravest of us all, weren't you? Oh my gosh. Loyal, but hoping for a different outcome. I'm gonna cry. So I'm sorry I miss you. And I'm so sorry. I'm not crying. I'm not crying. Oh my gosh. Oof. I don't know why that just got me. Whew. <laughs> Oh man, my life is in shambles. No, the other one. I don't want to say too much on the phone. Call me back. <laughs> the Jack, which it's all pretty crazy. This isn't over. It's right. not his phone. I'm gonna find it's going to be a joke. Just wait for it. <sighs> okay, different joke. This reminds me of Jingle All the Way when he goes into the warehouse. Wait one second, please. Let me put on brass knuckles so I can punch your face. Whoa! <laughs> boop, boop, boop. Oh, man. I know how this is going to end. It's going to end in the showdown in Rockefeller Plaza with, uh, with the Christmas tree. And then we're going to get an action-packed final episode. Someone's hired a black widow. It's never far enough. 
If I don't end this tonight, uh, it's just a matter of time before the big guy gets involved. The big guy! The big guy, baby! Sure. Kingpin! I love you. Go ahead and this. Oh, he's doing it. Oh. How the heck is this episode gonna end? He's clearly outnumbered. Oh! <laughs> How many bullets was that? I wasn't counting. Oh, there we go. Hello, hello there, Miss Late. It's me, Swordman. Oh, photographic reflexes. Let's see. It. Oh, man. <gasps> it's me, Jessica. Family? It'll be the last thing that you do. You have my word. To be manipulated. By the big man. I know. Oh. Yes. You Wait, what? Boss. He was working for the big man during that five years. And then Kate coming in and saving the day, baby. Dude, that just might have gotten inter more interesting. That if Ronan, aka Clint, whatever, was working for the big man. And again, my theory is, everyone's theory, the big man is Kingpin. Wait, was Kazi the informant that wanted the father dead? Ooh. What are you talking about? Oh, so you know what? This is her out, probably. She's like, I'm out of here. I'm done with this. But her show will be some backstory. But also her cruising down the highway. She said she's Natasha's sister. Elena. The passing of the arrow, baby. That's it. She's Hawkeye now. Does that front of the building look familiar to anyone else? Where is it? Oh! <gasps> Wait, what? Okay. What? Well, that's the guy I've been worried about this whole time. Show the image of this mo yeah. Holy shit! <laughs> Wow, it's Kingpin, baby! Vincent D'Onofrio, Kingpin! Pa 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 pa! <laughs> and the music of the Grinch just ugh, take that away, take that away. Holy crap, people! Um, okay, that reveal. I mean, I wouldn't say it was super expected, but there was hints, there was rumors that a certain someone would show up, and uh, even more wrinkles into the plot. I think with one episode left, there's a lot to really button up. I'm getting ahead of myself. This episode, I thought was very much more of a heart-to-heart, -heart, inspirational, not inspirational, emotional episode of really getting to know characters and perspective and whatnot. With Yolanda coming in, talking with Kate, eating mac and cheese and whatnot, and then discuss, uh, discussing Clint uh, about him and whatnot. I like that. It did feel a little bit slower of an episode. Obviously, action with uh, the Ronin and the Maya situation. That situation, I think, is tied up, where Maya's probably going to help him out now. She's very cautious about the tracksuit mafia, obviously Kingpin, Vincent D'Onofrio, baby. Um, she's cautious about them. So I think that she might be actually closer to the side of Clint and Kate. Same with Yelana. So I'm curious on who is going to be going after them at the very end. Is it going to be Kingpin? Because Ronan, aka Clint, has been saying he's the one that's been he's been worried about the whole time. I think Clint was working for Kingpin the whole time during the blip, that five years. That makes sense because he was trying to get rid of all of the skeezy underworld type bosses so this guy could gain more and more and more and more power. It only makes sense, people. Really cool that he's coming back. That obviously opens the doors for a certain character, the, uh, the devil of hell's kitchen. I have a theory 
everyone does i'm sure he's gonna pop up in spider-man no way home who really knows i'm assuming yeah that's really cool though that he's in this world now but with him working with uh Bish elnor bishop's uh you know her or kate's mom whatever the swordsman i think is a is a big red herring and whatnot i think that kingpin killed or had kazi kill um armand so the whole swordsman mustache twirling bad guy it was a huge smokescreen. I think that there's definitely more going on there. Where what if Bishop is, uh, Elnor is like in cahoots with Kingpin. Like they've been working together. The Sloan thing, they put it under uh, the, the uh, our, what if not Armand's, uh, Jeffrey's name. We're going to call him Jeffrey because I'm blanking right now. But they put it under his name instead. I don't know. There's, again, there's a lot of moving parts and whatnot with only one episode. We know that there's going to be a huge showdown. But who are they showing down with? I still think that one of the highlights of this episode was obviously that two-second finish at the end. Two-second finish, I should know. I shouldn't have said that. Um, but you know what I mean. It was a great cliffhanger for this episode. Very excited for the next episode. Very excited for Spider-Man No Way Home. But uh, what did you think of this episode? Did you like it? Did you not like it? Were you in the between? What about that reveal? Did you know it was coming? What kind of theories do you have uh, coming out? Also, one thing I didn't even talk about. The beginning of this episode with Yelana getting dusted like that. That was really cool. That's all my thoughts, though. Um, very much looking forward to see uh, episode 6 and where the hell that's gonna go. But uh, be sure to like this video, subscribe, all of that stuff. It is far too late. I didn't drink enough coffee. Okay, I thought there was a bug in there. Uh, follow my TikTok, people. I'm doing a bunch of fun stuff over there. Let's get, let's get it, people. Let's get it. Um, anyway, I'm gonna try to edit this quick. Bye-bye. Ah, and Kingpin, baby. Kingpin.